Well, hello, my friend, and welcome to my channel. Today, I'm going to share my Thanksgiving Manny. I've started off with Nail Teaks Formula 2, and here is Native War Paints, and this one is Hide. I'm going in with that first coat. This polish is so pretty. It's got a blue flash and shimmer that just, mm, I knew it would be great for a base for a manicure. So there's that first coat. Goes on easy. And now we're going to do our second coat. The formula on this one's just perfect. I didn't have to do any cleanup, and I like that. I like it very much. Now I could have stopped here probably at two coats, but I'm going to go ahead and do a third. Just because I plan on wearing this for a few days to get through Thanksgiving. <laughs> Here we go with that final coat. Beautiful. There we go. I'm going to top it with some Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat and get it to dry down. Oh, and I have messed up my metal nail. I'm going to show you how I fix that just as soon as I get done top coating this can be fixed. It can be saved. I've got a little dampened dish with some acetone sitting out so I'm gonna tap my finger down into it and just using my fingertip I'm gonna smooth that out. Look, barely even can tell I did anything. Today I'm gonna be using BMH13 and this Moira foil polish for stamping and my AliExpress stamper and my Beauty Big Bang scraper. I've got a piece of orange foil out. And we're just going to get some of these designs off of this plate and put them on the nails. So first you stamp it on and it didn't, it's not real opaque like regular stamping polish. But then you got to let it sit for 30 seconds and then you start tapping in the foils. It's a little different than working with foil glue but very very neat idea. I'm so glad they came up with something like this. But you just keep tapping until you get the desired look you want. So that was the turkey and now I'm going to do the cornucopia. If you hear some crunching in the background, that's Cotton enjoying himself. And then another 30 seconds you gotta wait and and I would just do one nail at a time using this this type of, you know, medium. And this one's really kind of hard to see with the where, where, I, where I need to keep adding some too, but you just keep doing it until you're happy with it. And this image is going to go on my pinky. Going to leave some of that base color sticking out there on the tip. And wait another 30 seconds and go in with that foil. Now Moira's got this in I think three colors. It's white, silver, and black. And I just decided to use the black today because I wanted to make sure that this popped. You know, I want to be able to see the images. I also wanted to show that this Moira foil stamping polish comes up with the tape trick. At least the black one does. We'll try the silver one later, but today I'm playing with this one, so came up really well. Not a lot of mess to clean up there. And then I'm going to put this full image here on my pointer finger. Fingernail. And I did my thumb off camera. I'll show it on my swatch photo at the end. And here we go with some foil application. Just kind of rubbing it in. It's really cool though. I really like it. I've tried to do this with regular polish and I've had very little luck. So I had to try these out. I'm going to top this with uh, Revolution by Picture Polish. It's made for foils and this will keep it from crackling or getting all funky looking. And you're just going to apply that and let it dry all the way down. And then I'm going to add this top coat from uh, Vibrant Vinyls called Fast and Hard and seal this design in. There we go. There's my manicure. I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope you have a 
very happy Thanksgiving. That is it for today. I want to thank you for stopping by and watching. Until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.